Revised in 2013, the Comprehensive Sexual Education course is part of the Life Skills subject and aims to give learners in Grade 4 to Grade 12 the knowledge, attitude, skills and values to make appropriate and healthy choices in their sexual lives. In an interview with NAMPA, the Ministry of Education, Arts and Culture, Deputy Director of HIV and AIDS Management, Julius Nifikwa, explained that since its introduction in 2013, the course received some mixed emotions by some religious leaders, parents and teachers who said the content learners will be exposed to would further encourage them to engage in sex and inappropriate sexual contact. A parent from Dortabes, where teenage pregnancy is high, Frederica Gomajas welcomed the program, saying the youth, especially from peri-urban areas, engage in early sexual activities due to hardships. I think it is good. They must learn from a young age what sex is and what menstruation is, so they know how their body develops in the future. I really feel it should be done, especially here in Dortabes because our children until now don't know how to tell their parents they are sexually active or are in relationships. Such things are kept under wrap here. A 13-year-old learner from Dortabes Primary School, a letterbox said, having comprehensive sexual education in school is important as learners will be exposed to their knowledge about the dangers and consequences of engaging in sexual activities. As a child, I need to know how and when to abstain and when to have sex. It's important to know that because if you have sex and get pregnant, you don't even know if you have HIV. Comprehensive sexual education was revised as part of a Southern African Development Community meeting held in 2013 to help curb the HIV epidemic amongst the youth. Josephine Simeon, Nampa News.